Alright guys, if you're interested in knowing how to make this J.J. Smith Green Smoothie Cleanse approved snack, stay tuned. Hi guys, here you'll see pictures of the ingredients that I used for this amazing tuna slash egg salad. Later on in the video, you can get the measurements of how much you need. Remember, you can always leave out or add whatever you want. Just make it to your liking. All right, enjoy. This recipe is just something that I've come up with that I like a lot. <laughs> um, so I'm making enough for three days. I have three. I have three packs of this tuna. You can use whatever brand you want. This is 2.6 ounces. So basically, it's like as if I was eating a pack a day. Um, and then I have six eggs which means I will be eating like two eggs a day. Instead of making it all boring and just eating plain tuna and plain eggs and oh God, I'm making something that I can enjoy. Um, so let's get started. I'm gonna smash up these eggs. I really can smash them up on top of the tuna actually. Sorry about the clinging. I'm not going to add any salt in this. Only thing seasoning I will be adding is um, Mrs. Dash Chipotle seasoning. I really love the Jess Mayo Chipotle Mayo. It's bomb.com, but instead I'll be using this one. Just some mustard. I measured out everything. Of course, you can tweak it how you want. You can leave out whatever you like. I'm adding red bell pepper, um, red onion, mayo mustard in that seasoning. And this glass might be a little bit too small, but we'll make it work. I'll be back when I get it all right. This is good enough for me. You can continue to chop if you want your eggs smaller than this. Um, I don't mind. And plus, as I continue to mix everything in, I'll be chopping. So, I guess I'll start by adding... This is one-eighth of a small red onion. Uh, this is literally a, just a small one of these. About this much red bell pepper you can tweak it how you want if you don't like onion don't add it I'm one that loves onion um, I'll go ahead and add my wet ingredients this is just the um, I did three tablespoons of mayo so as if I'm eating one tablespoon of mayo a day so you know if you don't want certain things don't have it but I'm doing what works for me that helps me stick to this cleanse so I've done this cleanse multiple times I've lost weight every single time so this is just what I've learned to tweak over time so we're just gonna mix this together um, and you know smaller people can take less calories you know us larger folks we need more calories to survive <laughs> So just tweak it for you. If you like more mayo, if you want less mayo, more mustard, less mustard. That's basically, this is basically it. And just stir it until it gets mixed all good. I'm not gonna waste your time to continue to stir this on camera. It's really delicious. Um, you can eat them with celery. My favorite, all-time favorite, that's why I have these like this, I eat them 
like chips and dip with red bell pepper. I totally forgot to turn my fan off. I'm so disappointed. I hope it's not too loud in the background. You also can just eat it with some carrots. It's all. And that's basically it. Cucumbers. I have another recipe coming up in a second to show you how to make my spicy cucumber salad. Bomb.com. It's amazing what you can come up with when you're limited to what you can eat. And it's healthy, it's vegan, and it's amazing, especially if you like spice. If you don't like spice, leave the spice out. My all-time favorite anyway, it's lemon pepper cucumber, but I don't want to add any salt to it, so I'm just going to do these plain natural ingredients that you will see soon. So thank you for taking the time to watch this video. I hope y'all enjoy this tuna salad, tuna slash egg salad. It's really amazing. If you make this, please let me know what you think. Let me know what you changed. Let me know what you added. I love trying new things. So don't forget to subscribe so you can see what comes up during the next few days. This is day three for me. I'm going to make a video showing what snacks you can have, kind of more in detail. And then I'm also going to let you know how I feel. I mean, I guess you can hear the energy in my voice. Can you feel it? I feel amazing. Okay? But we're going to save that for the next video. I'm going to keep this short and simple. Have a good day. And remember, always be the charming one.